let's look at creating a GitHub connector in Harness platform. And as a prerequisite, let's first create and get the GitHub personal access token. So head over to github.com. On top right corner, click on your profile, settings. Scroll down and choose developer settings. Personal access tokens. Select tokens classic. Click on generate new token. Generate new token classic. Give it a name. Harness Git Connector. Set an expiration date. And select the scopes you would like to grant this token. Click on Generate Token. Now copy this GitHub Personal Access Token and store it somewhere safe. You can also refer GitHub Docs uh, for creating a personal access token. And if you want to use your token within GitHub organization that uses SAML single sign-on, then you can refer this doc. Uh, links are provided in the description. Now go to app.harness.io, click on New Connector, choose the type GitHub, give it a name, Git Connector, click Continue. So there are two URL types. Uh, if you choose account type, this connector will connect to your entire Git org. And if you choose repository type, it will just connect to a single repo in the org. Choosing account type allows you to use one connector for all of your subordinate repos in a GitHub organization. So for this demo, I'll choose account type and the connection type is HTTP. Let's give the GitHub account URL. Let's use the test repo. This repo is available in Linux Automates. Click continue. GitHub username, Linux Automates. Let me create a new secret. Harness git pat. Copy the value that we got from uh, GitHub. Click save. Enable API access. Harness git pat. And apply selected and click continue. Let me choose connect through a harness delegate. I deployed my own delegate, so let me choose that. Let me delegate and uh, click save and continue. Now harness will use the delegate to test the connector that we just created and it's successful. So thanks for watching this video and subscribe to Harness Community YouTube channel to watch more such videos.